Hello everyone, welcome back, and we're playing more Final Fantasy X-2, 30% complete with the game, Chapter 2. Last time we did the annoying uh, gauntlet, stupid, stupid side quest in Pesade Island, and today we'll be doing Kilika Island and Luka. Kilika Island, we'll go to first, because it's probably the fastest thing you've ever seen. Honestly, we'll be here literally about a minute, not even, so, I'll show you. The Gullwings, was it not? Sphere hunters that give back spheres. Don't you think that's a little odd? Of course, we're glad you're on the youth league side, but still. But still! And then you talk to Donna, and she says, We're having a little spat with New Yevon. Just when we need no rest for the weary, dear, you want to keep her distance. And then if we talk to her again, it says, the Same thing. And, folks, that's all you have to do here. So. Back to the annoying airship we go, with the annoying music. And off to Luca we go. Oh yeah, excitement. Excitement, baby. So, tell us, buddy, where are we going today? Off to Luca Stadium. Got something stuck in my throat. Ugh. Annoying. Welcome, folks, to Luca Stadium. Yeah. We find all the cool stuff around here, baby. So all we do is head down the steps, get the treasure chest, which for some reason we haven't gotten yet. But light curtains. I could have sworn we gotten that already, but I guess not. <laughs> Sneeze. Hold it. <coughs> there you go. And proceed to the next area. Where we initialize another cutscene. Because that's what Final Fantasy X-2 is about. Terrible cutscenes. Hello and good afternoon, Luca. Good this afternoon. Is Shinda, bringing you all the latest news from throughout Spira. These days, everyone's talking about the groups battling throughout Spira for control of the spheres. Let's start with the Youth League. From its leader, Maven Nuge, on down, their ranks are made up mostly of former Crusaders. Fresh off its attack on Kilika Temple, feel free to the switch your cameras whenever you feel like it. Don't really have to, but. Pairing off against them is none other than New Yevon. All eyes were on them after the New Yevon chairman's sudden resignation. Chaos seemed inevitable. But their newly appointed leader, Crater Barrelai, has held them together with utmost Shalinda, finesse. Shalinda, when have you become so boring? Another group turning a lot of heads is the Machine Faction, an Albed organization. They've managed to distance themselves from the sphere struggle in Broiling Spirit. Yuna, are you getting married? Remember that. Let's see more. Prowess could well no. be enough to dramatically shift the balance of power. And let's not forget the LeBlanc Syndicate, the gang with a style all its own. Headquartered at Chateau LeBlanc in Guadalajara, its agents span the globe. But lately, there's one group in particular that's been drawing all kinds of attention. That's right, the only group led by a high summoner, the Goldwings. The Goldwings. Here's today's special guest, High Summoner Yuna. Wait a minute, I didn't huh? agree to this. Break a leg. The Pain Lady Network. Luna, your concert the other day was nothing short of spectacular. Well, it was sort of me up there, but not exactly. Puzzling words, to be sure. And speaking of puzzling, why the sudden career change to spear hunting? It sounds like you caused quite a stir with that disappearing act you pulled on Visaid. And I'm very sorry about that. Rumor has it you left the island looking for clues about a certain young man. Anything you can share with us? Um, I don't think it really matters what you pick here. I'm not sure, but I guess I'll just choose the first option. So, tell us about him. It's a long story. I'm sure it is. One can only imagine the fascinating tales that led to you becoming the leader of the Goldwings. Hold it right there! I am the leader. Me, Goldwings, we rock you! Whoa! We will, we it's will you are, right you. Now. This is just a toy compared to the things I've invented. 
tell us. Good for Is you, Shinra. Is it true that the Gullwings have thrown their support behind the Youth League? That yep. statement is kind of true, but not really. No! Uh, we don't want to get caught up in other people's problems. So many questions left to ask, but I'm afraid we're out of time. That's all right, because you're a horrible interviewer anyway. Hi, Summoner Yuna and the Gold Wings. And the Dull Wings. Horrible. She didn't even ask any follow-up questions. That just... Whew. That's awful. Not bad. You should have joined in too. Yeah, it was more fun watching. Lady Unit, great interview. Thank you so much for helping me out. This isn't much, but consider it a token of my gratitude. Yay, another stupid garment grid. How many so, of them are we going to get? How long have you been doing this? Well, after the calm came, the temples were in decline. At first, I thought the best thing I could do would be to help the temples get back on their feet. But everyone just ordered me around. I got tired of it. You couldn't just tell them no? That's the part of me I wanted to change. I made up my mind to leave the temple and come here to Luca. They well, don't you feel special? And they asked me to help, so here I am. Another job you were asked to do? I suppose nothing about me has really changed after all. Oh, I gotta run. Oh, my next assignment is about to start. See you later, Lady Yuna. Bye! She complains, but you can tell she enjoys it. Hmm, of sounds course. Sounds a bit like Uni, don't you think? Really? Yeah, you're a whiner. Remember your your pilgrimage? Complaining all the time. But that was Orin's line anyway, not yours, Riku. Stop stealing Orin's. Care to give us your opinion? The hardest person to know is yourself. Oh my God. Hey, cut that out. Hey, you guys are corny. Okay, and all that's left to do now in Luca is more publicity crap, and this is probably going to frustrate you viewers because I have no idea what I got to do here in terms of publicity, so what I think I'm going to do is I have um, somebody who's done a 100% run of this already, he's done a very good job, Zachary Ch Zach. Zachary Ochokum. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong, but he's done a very good guide on this, and he's actually been helping me out as guide. Now, what I want to do here is we're going to do the publicity thing. However, my issue here is I have no idea where to start, and I think it starts with this lady. So I have his video running, and I'm going to see what he chooses. So. Alright, this looks like. It's this lady first, publicity, and you choose option three. Okay, so far that's good. And then um, we want to do matchmaking. And we want to do option two. Okay, now you're going to notice I'm going to stand still a lot here. And that's just because I'm trying to figure out where I want to go. And I think it's... Let me watch his video here. This is kind of retarded because I'm kind of like watching his video. And uh, doing this at the same time. But I think next would be this person. And we want to do publicity. And it's the last option. Okay, so far so good. But we want to do it again. And we want to go to matchmaking. And we want to do option three. Okay, now where do we go? Doo -doo -doo -doo. I don't mind this music that much, it's not as horrible. Okay, now we gotta talk to... I think it's this person here. Well, let's see, I think it's option four. Okay, so far so good. Okay, 
Okay, we got that done. Just following his guide, folks. That's why I'm kind of quiet. I'm trying to watch his video here. It's a little confusing. Just a little bit. Come on, Zachary, choke him, you're confusing me. Watching his video. This is like retarded. I'm like following a guide and doing things at once. It's so strange. Okay, nothing here. He looks absolutely lost as well. <laughs> this is so stupid, this publicity thing. It really is. He's going publicity. Hmm. I guess he's just randomly talking to everybody. <laughs> I don't know, folks. I'm just following him. Bear with me. Luca, I enjoyed this play so much better when we were playing Blitzball. I really did. What happened? You know, I actually remember myself. I could have sworn that there's someone else to speak to here. Ah, wait, wait, wait. No, we gotta rewind it. Crap, crap, crap. I missed it. Hold on. What do you choose? Sorry, folks. Now I got this. Okay, and then we want to talk to this lady here and choose option. Uh... <sighs> I hate this mini game with a passion. That and we want to do matchmaking option two. There you go. Now we're anywhere else. Derp. Okay, now we're on the right track, I think. He looks confused in his video, just like me. Gotta sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me, Dario. Where are we going? Where are we going? Nothing like exploring Luca, folks. It's so exciting. My question is how in the world are you supposed to know this stuff if you don't test? If you don't, like, if there was no guide to this, how in the world are you supposed to know this? You know what I mean? Shit. Wait, 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 go back, go back. Zachary choke him, go back. Um I think I kinda 
kind of missed it. I think he chose option. Uh, four. Shit! No! No, go back! I gotta talk to her again. Where is she? Wait, come back! Come back, loopy lady! Option number... Option, option, which option are we going to choose? Folks, I apologize. Option two. There. There. Okay, we got that right. Are we done with the stupidness? I don't know how many times you have to do this. I don't even remember. Hopefully this is it. Because this minigame is nothing short of frustrating. Look at this, um, you guys probably fell asleep already, I, I, I don't know what to say. I'm sorry! Well, I think this is it, yup, he saves the game, so... Okay guys, I apologize for that horribleness, this is all the time we have for today's episode. We will see you next time. See what percentage we're at. Thirty-one, maybe. Thirty-one. We'll see you guys next time. I apologize for the boringness. We'll see you next time for more Final Fantasy X-2. Peace out.